Congratulations. I, uh, someone told me today it's been 25 years this yeah. year that you've been doing stand-up comedy. That's right. I don't, I don't know how or I didn't, I didn't get any better. Um, <laughs> I didn't. I absolutely did, didn't know. I you didn't get better. You're the same now as I you am, were 25 years ago. I am. I used to come on. I didn't remember anything. You know, I would always I would freak out and, uh, and look at people and say, and then start talking about not what I'd meant. And then they stayed. And 25 years. Thank you. Thank you very much. I made it. That's it. You're dead. Yeah. You act like this is it now. You're getting that's out. That's it. That's it. I'm waiting for someone to come along with a clock and a cup and a package holiday, a caravan maybe. A... See, there's nothing like that in comedy. You could do 25 years. If you worked in a bank, they'd give you a gold watch. You'd have they'd something. Give, they'd give you something. You'd have something. That and doesn't you... happen in this business. No, you get, I, I have uh, some laundry receipts. And uh, <laughs> I, I know where you can buy Doritos pretty much anywhere, but yeah. that's it. That's it. That's all you can get. Well, you know, let's talk about things I'm curious about. For example, St. Patrick's Day. The United States, they make such a big deal yeah. out of it. And I know that the tradition in Ireland is, is quite different. What did you do on St. Patrick's Day? Did you go, do you go crazy? Which, which, which no, way No, the two traditions in Ireland are very simple. You people have some sandwiches and they, they're hanging around because it's a holiday. And then the other tradition is you take your top off and you get onto a roof and you challenge whole population centers to a fight. Um, <laughs> and I didn't do that because I'm, I'm having a holiday from booze. So, oh, how yeah. long is your holiday from booze been? Well, I did dry January, which is a thing people do a lot uh, in Ireland and Britain, and uh, I lost 485 pounds. <laughs> and I, <laughs> so I thought I'd better, I might Yeah, you look better, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, I, you know, I thought I might see what happened in February. Is that really, is that really quite popular, that people do a dry Yeah, January? it is, it's not a choice. People don't do it because they go, oh, this is a healthy lifestyle choice. They do it because they're about to die. Yeah. And um, <laughs> that's how people make those choices. They do it against their will. Um, Are you finding that with, without drinking in your life, do you feel like there's more you can accomplish, there's more you can do? No, there's certainly more I can experience because days are so incredibly long. 385,000 hours in a day without there's alcohol. There's not 385,000 hours there is. in a day. You can check. <laughs> it's, great. It's, it, it's great if you're a fan of you. Uh huh. If right. you're a fan of yourself, because yeah. you get to have much more uninterrupted time of your own consciousness. Yes. But I find that gets a bit wearisome after about hour 389. Yeah. Um, but it does maybe explain why Trump is famously teetotal. Yeah. There's a guy who loves him. He so likes to be with him. He wants to spend more time with Donald. You and think that that's... You think Donald Trump doesn't drink yes, because he wants I more do. alone time with himself. That's right. He wants a concentrated experience of pure Trumposity, so he doesn't, <laughs> he doesn't want to mess it up with any booze. Um, I love that theory. Uh, I'll entertain that theory.